Now our natural health guest today is a strong advocate of raw and organic food and believes everyone would benefit from cleaning out their diet. Welcome to the Harvey Norman Lounge wellbeing consultant Christine Smith. Thank you. Have you um, how did you become interested in raw food? I've always been interested in natural health mm. and about nine years ago our daughter said mum would you join me on a detox please you have to re eat all raw food for two weeks will you do it? I said Arr. okay um, so we did and I just felt so good we just kept going in varying ratios over the years Right, yes. so you're not 100% raw? No. Because that would be very difficult to maintain. Well it, well, it is, and I actually choose to eat from all of the food groups, and I encourage my clients to do the same. Mm. So what did you notice? What were some of the benefits that you noticed instantly? The first thing I really noticed was I had more energy, and I so wish I knew about this when my children were young. We could all deal with a bit more energy. Absolutely, we sure do. And then other benefits start kicking in, like there's usually some weight loss going on. They also call nice. it yes. <laughs> they call it the anti-aging diet, and who wouldn't like <laughs> yes. that? Um, you know, my hair was stronger, my nails were stronger, and, and I just felt really good. You're really selling this particularly well to me, I must <laughs> say. So, what are the first steps in that we should be taking if we want to clean up our diets a bit? What are some small things that we can do? Well, I think the first thing, and it's really important, especially if you have health issues, is to see your doctor. Mm -hmm. They've got to know about it. And then it's about baby steps, small steps. Upping your water intake, swap out soft drinks for sparkling water. I love that. Mm -hmm. um, and start eating up more real food so that you know what's in it. And that in itself means you're eating less processed food and more fresh, whether it's cooked or raw. And somebody said if you're going to the supermarket, eat the things that are on the outside of it yes. because they're all the natural things. That's where the fruit and veg and everything are. Mm. What sort of health issues can be improved with a raw diet? Well, again, I think it's more that your body is designed to know what to do with real food and food is designed to deliver it. Mm. And the more real food you're eating, you're upping your natural intake of vitamins, minerals, fibre and other nutritional benefits. So your body's naturally going to benefit. So it, you start feeling better, it improves your health and in some cases it can enhance healing. And it really is, I mean we all want our bodies to have the most energy that we can and there's yes. such intricate things, the way our bodies work when you start reading about it, you think how do we even, how can we do anything without all the stuff going on inside of us mm. at the same time in the right way. Uh, you hold workshops too and you give consultations, what are the most common things people talk to you about? they're nervous that they're going to have to put up with rabbit food and it's so not like that. Raw food can be really delicious and it's actually my business to make it so. I'm not interested in boring food. Um, so I coach them through at their own speed. They get recipes. If they need shopping, I'll help them through it. But they're always in control of their diet. It's, it's my goal to teach and guide them. Because a lot of people do think that if they eat raw, then they lose all the taste, but that's not the case, is it? Oh, no. No, it enhances the taste. And it always looks beautiful, the colours. You've actually brought some things in today, yes. which I've been waiting to talk about because <laughs> I want to try one of these. All right. uh, but these are some of your favourite things that you've mm -hmm. got here, and you've also made something as well. Yes. Talk me through what you've got here. Right. First and foremost, because my sweet tooth is very real, so it's in my interest to have very nice sweet food. This is a fresh, rocky road. So I've got, um, for this one I bought the real deal raw chocolate and just melted it down, but you could use any good quality high cocoa okay. chocolate. And I've got blueberries and almonds in there. You've got fresh blueberries fresh in there? Fresh blueberries, yes. Oh, I can't mm. wait, that looks delicious. Yes. What are these things that you've got, obviously dates? Yes. All right, the other uh, product I brought in today is a red capsicum vinaigrette, mm -hmm. absolute queen of salad dressings. And these are all the ingredients that go in it. So the viewers can see that there's only real food that's gone into this dressing and the colour of the red um, capsicum just makes it taste and look amazing. I don't look smell of it because it looks stew. incredible. Yeah. Um, and obviously these are things that you cook with all the time, the dates for the sweet treats. Yes. What's this one here? That's ground flaxseed. Oh, okay, and what's that good for? Well, it na it's a natural Ooh. thickener, but it's also incredibly good for, for your gut. It's good fibre and it's excellent omegas. And this is salt at the back there? It's Himalayan salt there. What makes that so special, the Himalayan? Um, Himalayan salt is, is actually loaded with trace minerals, so it's not an empty salt as well accustomed to when we think of normal table salt mm -hmm. so it's 
it's a good salt. So those are my favourite things too. Salty, sour yes. and sweet treats yeah. as well. This mm. capsicum dressing smells absolutely delicious. Yes, thank and you. I'm sure that's going to be full of flavour. Yeah. It has been an absolute delight having you in the studio. Oh, you, you are going to be leaving this one behind, aren't you? The little chocolate one? Of course I am. Excellent. <laughs> Sounds good. And don't forget there are heaps of natural health tips and information in this month's Health 2000 magazine. So drop in store and pick one up for free. Thank you so much for coming in, Christy.